Hello everyone, my name is Georgia Block Thief, and today I'm going to be doing a quick tutorial video. Since I don't have much time, I'm just going to be doing this quickly. Um, this is going to be a bit of a house build tutorial. No, um, not referring to someone else. <clears throat> I'm serious. Um, yeah, this is just going to be a quick house build video. Um, yeah, so what you'll need for this typical oak house is some oak wood planks, oak wood, oak wood stairs, oak wood slabs, oak leaves, which you can harvest out of shears, and a wooden door. You can do an iron door, you can do any redstone you want, but I'm doing a basic wooden door for now. Now, I have uh, sort of flattened out this area all over here. Uh, it's not a perfect square. I don't believe it's a perfect square. A square does not look like one, but if it is, uh, I, I, I tried and I, and I did well. So, uh, one, two, three... Wait, one, two, three. We're going to put that there. And then we're going to place all of these along the side like this. So one, two, three. So we're going to place that there and then continue on. There we go. So once we continue on all around, uh, we can continue with the rest of the house. Uh, but to finish up... Um, what we have to do is uh, actually uh, do the fr the whole frame of the house, which I'm going to show you guys how. Uh, this isn't like a like a in depth house build thing. It's just it's just I I I know what I did was wrong. No one saw anything. Um, yeah. So basically. Um, this isn't much, it's just like a normal house build. Uh, not trying to incorporate any redstone into this. I do know a bit, but I'm not that good at it. So, one, two, three, four, five. Let's do five high, and then we're going to go up and around like that. Make it a big cube. One, not one by one. I'll forget it. Um, yeah, so I'll be back when I'm done. Okay, once you're done the entire frame, uh, continue on with the floor and have it as wooden planks, not slabs, because on slabs, if you place them down above them, there'll be a bit of a half slab high space, and we don't want that because if there's going to be any interior design happening, um, we don't want that. <coughs> and uh, just for the aesthetic uh, quality, um, and because I'm a perfectionist, it's hard for me to put those slabs. But if you're if you're designing your interior, uh, the interior of a house, not not your real one, unless you're an interior designer, which you probably are in Minecraft. But anyway, uh, if you're designing the interior of your house um, in Minecraft, uh, I'm getting carried away. If you're designing the interior of your house, just remember to um, to not put slabs on the ground. Uh, yeah, you can put them outside here, but remember that uh, you should not be putting them. Like, I'm probably going like, to just put them around the sides, but not have anything above them. Or, if I do want to have something above them, maybe for like a small shelf, quote-unquote. Uh, yeah, so I'll be back when I've done the entire wall, and you guys can copy off when you're, if you're building yours and stuff. And if chunks are still loading in, don't blame me. They're probably not loading in, but anyway, yeah. Something else to note, um, I'm just going to be building like what I intend to build. You guys can change this up however you want. Um, but also um, with the door, I'm going to, as you can see, I'm not leaving a space for the door door could be on any side I'm gonna build it on a specific side later on but not at the moment um, yeah so basically what you want to do my window design I've decided uh, sorry I'm using the mine camera more than decided just not to use it in the end um, I've decided to make it like that so there's gonna be some uh, stained glass uh, but on here on this side, you have three empty spaces, so you just put one in the middle, just so that it's symmetrical. 
uh, and no, it is not a perfect square. Although it sort of does look nice now, <laughs> one could say it's a perfect square, but on this side, it's not perfect. So, um, yeah, don't try to model my design because it's not perfect, as I already said. But, uh, yeah, so when I'm, and just do that, do this for this side. Uh, I've decided to do it sort of like that, make it sort of look like a bridge, sort of ish, maybe. Um, yeah, so I'm going to continue on all the other sides, and when I'm done, I'm back. I cut the recording early. Uh, when I'm done, I'm going to uh, continue the tutorial. Also, something that I just noticed uh, the door. Well, you could have any kind of door. This, where I'm building it, is high in the sky. There really is no way to get up except if you pillar jump um, you could create a way down uh, through the ground um, you could do anything you want with this um, but I'm not gonna fill anything in now uh, I'm just gonna save it the way it is uh, yeah so basically I finished this part um, it's just gonna be a one-story uh, house okay there's gonna be the attic but anyway uh, yeah, there will be the attic just above right here, but uh, that is all that I'm doing for now. Yeah. What I'm doing now is continuing uh, four blocks up from this frame. Um, it's going to be, it's going to look a tad different than you'd expect it to look. I'm not going to actually connect these uh, four pillars. Um, they're just going to be there. What I'm going to start doing now is doing the oak uh, stair pattern uh, which can actually be quite tedious uh, because you keep going around and around doing the exact same thing um, and you don't feel like you're getting anywhere but the finished product you are getting somewhere so whenever you're building a house uh, in Minecraft, um, like look we've already done quite a bit <laughs> we've like started working on the stairs we've done the main design of the main floor um, so quite a bit has been done um, so now we're starting on the roof and that's actually great um, and what I'm probably going to do is continue up to the middle uh, sort of give it a triangular prism look um, just so that it looks like a normal roof uh, and not like an abnormal roof I believe there was yet yeah, that was a bug glitch yeah that definitely was a bug glitch but yeah when you're uh, continuing with the next side build like that and just do the corners first so they can connect um, do the three parts of the corner and then break the bottom blocks and then just continue on. This is the worst part because it takes so much time, so much time and effort to complete it. And sometimes you get corners like that. So what you have, to, I can't actually see my crosshairs. I'm not sure why, but what you have to do is stand right beside it and then, and then uh, place the stair. So this will take some time. When I'm done the entire roof, I will be back. I have not reached the top yet, but what I want to do is change up my design and put some slabs here at the top so that it's not even, like it's it doesn't go all the way to the top, but I can still place stairs here. I'm not going to give it that extra even look. I'm just going to uh I'm just going to put some extra slabs here just so that uh puts a bit of a ring around it. Um so that it just gives it some, again, aesthetic quality. Uh, so it goes all around. And there's your roof. Now, doesn't l that look unique? Um, it looks really nice, actually. I like the design of it. Uh, I like everything about it. And, yeah, that will actually end off this part of the how to build a house tutorial. Uh, but before that, I'd like to just place the door so that there actually is a door um, but yeah uh, that's basically the, the, the design 
um, and actually in the top floor here replace that it's not that dark because you still have light spilling in through the cracks so yeah I hope you all like this video I have no clue how I got it I, I, did I get through here Eh, doesn't matter well it sort of does but there we go got him so I will see you all in the next part of this uh, tutorial video and get off. Mm -hmm.